Uh, hi everybody uh, in this session uh, we would be looking at how to do a search functionality in the SAP uh, for example if you would like to find out any of the master data or if you'd like to find out any of the transactional data or you would like to find out any of the uh, documents how would you do a search uh, we will look at we would have a look at it now let's say that if, if you would like to uh, find out a vendor my plant is like let us suppose thousand uh, and I would like to find out the vendors associated to thousand plants. So how would I, how would I do that? Now, usually the uh, for this there are two options. One is either you could uh, go and you can find out the details via the table that we will look up in uh, upcoming sessions. However, right now we will do a basic search functionality. Uh, so the vendor creation transaction code is XK01. So I would go to XK01, and here uh, you can see here that you have a company code you have a purchasing organization you have a vendor now if you'd like to find out the vendor now i do not know the number and i would like to search so i would click on this or i would do an f4 the shortcut key is f4 so i would click on this now here you can see that there are so many tabs so if you click on this icon here you will find out all the tabs which are present now these tabs they give different search functionality based on different fields for example you can see here vendors by real estate contract or with plant reference with material purchasing class address attributes tax information personal number country company code country or company code so what happens it would be more appropriate say for example if i know that uh, i i'm looking out for a certain vendor who sends me a material xyz so in that case, I would go and I would select vendors by material. Now here, I can either give the material number or the vendor material number or the purchase organization or the vendor. Now, just because I do not know the vendor. So in this case, let me say if I'm finding out, if I'm trying to find out for the purchase organization 1000. So I would just say purchase organization is equal to 1000 and I will just hit enter. However, prior to that, the one important thing what we know, what we should note here is the maximum number of hits. Now here it, it is right now saying 500. Now, if you want to go for the maximum, you can always give it as 9999 and then hit enter. It will pull up all the uh, records up till 9999. If in case you want to restrict it, that you want to only look at for 10 or 5 or 1, so you can give that many. So it will fetch only that many records now i'm just giving 100 right now and then i hit enter let's see what happens so you can see it has picked up now you can see here it says that more than 100 input options now this is a material 100 hyphen 100 and you can see there are different vendors like 1000 to uh, 2093 then uh, t hyphen k 500 c01 2 0080 2 0080 so these are different vendors now if i would have known the material number and i would have um, tried to find out then in that case i would have straight away given the material number say here say for example this one is 100 hyphen 100 let us assume so i would have given 100 hyphen 100 and i would not have given the purchase organization and i would have straight away hit enter now you can see here it will straight away give me the vendor material number like one here 100 hyphen 100 hyphen 3411 now here you can see that these many vendors are available from home we are actually buying this particular material you can see here you have vendor 1000 1001 1002 1005 double nine double nine then you have 1000 1003 now if i know that what my purchasing organization is and i would like to be uh, pull up any of the reports based on the purchasing organization then i would give my purchasing organization here and I, if I do not remember the material number, so I would go. So let me pick up a purchasing organization and I would say hit. Now you can see here that it this purchasing organization is having only one material and it has picked up that particular material number. So this is my vendor in this case. And if I would like to go and if I would like to see all the details pertaining to this, you just have to hit enter. Now it says it's already exists. Reason being, I am in XK01, which says create vendor. So if I would have to look at all the other details, then in that case, I would go in XK02 or XK03. 
only for display is xk03 sorry i right typed wrongly uh the details we would look at in the upcoming sessions thank you for watching this video